Uh, right now, they'll want to send things over to our man, Jamie Goodfriend. He is at German Mills Public School this morning, checking out nutrition. What's up, Jamie? Yes, we are here for a uh, nutrition revolution, and this is also a little bit of a trip uh, down memory lane for me, Gertie. I went to kindergarten at German Mills. Hey, guys, what's up, Mavericks? <laughs> Man, it is good to be back here at German Mills up in Thornhill. Guys, you guys ready to uh, have a revolution today? Yeah! A nutrition revolution. These kids are so excited. We're, we're all about health today, right, guys? Yeah. All right. I, I want to I introduce you to uh, Shauna Thomas over here, who is a, nut a holistic nutritionist, and you are uh, at the forefront uh, of the revolution. First, a little bit more about the initiative. Like, how did this all come about? You know what? Um, part of what I do is working with kids, and because my kids go to this school, I thought it would be great to bring some healthy foods in and get these challenges going and get these kids really excited about healthy eating. Okay, so let's start over here. Let's see what these kids are making. What, what's, with the, what's with the fruit and the water? Okay, so we've been doing challenges over the last month, and our first first one was infused water because we all know that pop isn't really an ideal drink for mm -hmm. kids, right? So we're giving them a new option and that's infused water and it puts the power into their hands to choose what they want to put in there. So we've got some citrus, we have some mint, we've got some cucumber and the kids can add whatever they want and they get really creative. It's cool. I smell something good over here. Guys, what are you what are you putting in your water? Um, I'm putting in lemon, lime and strawberry. And what about you, buddy? I got mint and strawberries. It, you know what? It smells. It smells Smells great, doesn't it? I know, and, and you know what, guys. At the end of the day, this is fun stuff. When you get the hands on, um, and by the way, Fredgy over here, he's got he's got a little broccoli on the brain this morning. <laughs> All right, Fredgy, you looking good, buddy? Come on over here. Uh, we are also making smoothies, and you've got all these amazing, amazing recipes on the board. That's right. So I want to teach the kids that a smoothie doesn't have to come from a restaurant because those are loaded with a lot of sugar, and they can equally be delicious with just frozen fruit and some milk and. And uh, we've added in a couple of hemp hearts and some kefir, and we're teaching kids about probiotics and healthy fats. Let's fire up the blender, shall we? Right, let's do it, Charlie. Charlie, fire it up. What's in the blender? Ooh. So in there, we've got banana, we've got frozen strawberries, uh, like I said, plain kefir, some hemp hearts, and some milk. That's it. Who wants some smoothie action? Woo! All right, what's what's your favorite ingredients for, uh, for smoothies, buddy? Uh, milk and banana. You know what I also like to put in the smoothies? Honey. Yeah. A little bit of honey and make it a little bit of sweet. Look at you, Smiley. Look at this guy's been smiling all morning. What's your name? Chase. Chase. What's uh? What's your favorite smoothie? What's What do you like putting in it? Milk and banana. Milk and bananas. All right, guys. We're going to be talking more about the nutrition revolution all morning long. It's great to be back here at German Mills. Yeah. All right, guys. We're going to send it back to you for now. Excellent. Amy, you know how I love cookies. Hopefully, you'll guide me through a nutrition revolution, my friend. You know, it's a great event. It is a great idea, especially given the fact that childhood obesity rates continue to rise. But uh, we're trying to tackle that problem. And right now, these kids here at German Mills are making some morning good stuff. We've uh, been making some smoothies, some infused water. But right now, they're doing a little parfait action. Hey, buddy, what's your name? Hi, Luke. Luke, what are you, what are you making? Uh, I don't know. You got some strawberries, some yeah. bananas. Yeah. We got some other fresh fruit. We got some yogurt over here. What's your name? Ethan. Ethan, why do you think it's important? Uh, 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 that we're doing in the nutrition revolution. Why is it important to eat nutritious food? Um, because, like you said, uh, child obesity is a big thing now, mm -hmm. and like we're trying to stay healthy at school mm -hmm. and trying to stay active. Exactly, and you know what? You are what you eat, yeah. and you know, good food is not only good for the soul; it's good for the brain as well. It's good for the body. So I want to bring in uh, Shauna Thomas over here, who's uh, the nutritionist, who's helping these kids make these uh, parfaits. Yeah. Um, why parfait? You know what? It's a quick and easy breakfast for the kids, and it's got a lot of nutrition. It's got fiber, it's got protein, it's got fruit. It's mm -hmm. everything that you need in a cup on the go. And let's also talk about the importance of, you know, having these nutritious uh, meals, especially first thing in the day. These kids, they got to go off to school. Their brains, you know, they, they can get distracted very easily, and this helps with, with focus. Absolutely. Focus is huge, so I know teachers appreciate when they have a proper breakfast. It also helps their mood and their behavior. So when they have a proper breakfast full of fiber and protein, it's going to last a lot longer, and they're going to be able to concentrate in school. And what, what are, you know, if they don't do these kind of things, if they're not, you know, um, uh, consuming these healthy uh, foods, what, what kind of things can happen? Why, why is that a problem? Well, their blood sugar levels are going to 
to rise and fall so quickly. If they have a high sugar breakfast or something like that. So it's really, um, they, they can like not lose focus at school. Um, they can get into trouble. There's so many things and they can be hungry. And you know, if you're hungry, you're not mm -hmm. concentrating. You're not doing well at work, right? Mm -hmm. So you have to eat and you have to eat properly. And at the end of the day, I kind of look like the body is like a car and we need to put fuel in. We need to put the oil in and all the other, you know, fluids so that the car can run properly. So we're going to continue making these parfaits all part of the nutrition revolution. You guys having fun this morning, Mavericks? Yeah. See, they're that excited because they got all that energy in them from the food. All right, guys, we're going to set it back to you for now. All right, thank you so much, Jamie. We'll check in with you a little later on. Uh, right now, we want to send things over to Jamie Goodfreund. Uh, he is at uh, German Mills Public School, where I believe way back in the day, he was once a student. Jamie. Yes, I just uh, took a walk through my old stomping grounds here. I went outside. Uh, this is where we used to play uh, handball and uh, tag and all that other fun stuff that we used to do at uh, recess here at German Mills. Lucas, how you doing, buddy? Good. You having fun? Yeah. Are you learning about healthy foods and nutrition, about the nutrition revolution? Yeah, and P.S., Shauna's the best. Shauna is the best. What have you guys learned about uh, healthy foods and healthy eating? What's your name? Jordan. Jordan, what, what have you learned? I have learned that the more you eat healthy, the better you get, the better, more energetic and healthy. Right? Exactly. The stronger and smarter you will be. So right now, we're making some Greek pasta salad. Who likes pasta salad? <laughs> It's delicious, it's healthy, it's nutritious. Uh, I want to introduce uh, Ms. Burgard over here, one of the teachers. And, you know, you guys have been doing these challenges leading up to yes. this event. Tell yes. me about the, the first challenges. one was an infused water, so all the children were infusing water with fruit and vegetables, and my class got really injured. Some of them even had five vegetables uh, in each one. And then the second week, we did chickpea pasta salad, where they all made their own and had to bring it in and show us or tweet about it. And then we had them have healthy breakfast for a week. That's so they had to tell us what they were eating, and we talked about why that was a good thing to eat for breakfast. These are great, uh, you know, fundamentals to get into kids at, at such a young age. I also want to bring in Sean over here, our nutritionist. Uh, we're making some pasta salad. Yeah. What's what's uh, what are some of the ingredients that you have over here? It all looks delicious. So we're using a pasta that's made out of chickpea and lentil flour, mm -hmm. which is a little bit different for some of the kids. Um, and it's nice to have some options so that they know not all pasta is white pasta. Mm -hmm. And then we're adding some vegetables. We can keep it really simple. A lot of kids like cucumber, like cherry tomatoes. So we're adding those with a really simple olive oil and lemon dressing. And you know, I think one of the uh, the best ways to get kids in kind of into these you know smart habits mm -hmm. is to get them working with their moms with their dads and getting them hands-on because yeah. it's not only uh, educational it's fun for them absolutely and when it gets into the kids hands they're more likely to do it you can talk at them mm -hmm. all day long but if it's not something that they're actually doing at home and at school they're not gonna do it and you know what this is also gonna maybe help set them up for when they move on later in life when they go off to college or university yeah. and they're not just uh, eating you know things that are my microwavable or oh my God. something yeah. that's fast food. But this is, you know, these are good fundamentals starting from a young age. Absolutely. I really hope that this um, this really resonates with them and that they take it forward. And I'm hoping to do this every year with them. So Well, I think you guys are doing a fantastic job Thank here you. so far at uh, German Mills. You girls having fun? Yeah. You learning a lot? Yeah. All right. You were going to say, we're going to go to commercial break and we'll be right back. We're going to, we're on commercial break and we'll be right back. All we'll right. See you next time. On what channel? JB had some great tips on getting a good breakfast together. What else you got for us up at uh, Revolution Nutrition? Yeah, you know what? It's been great to be back here, uh, Bill, at my old stopping grounds here at German Mills, where I went to kindergarten. My brothers went to public school here as well. Did you guys have fun this morning? Yeah! yeah. Okay, we were learning so much about the nutrition revolution, uh, courtesy of Sean over here, and we, they've got some swag bags. What's going in the bags? Yeah, so every single kid in the school, 300 of them are getting a swag bag, and we've got some nut-free bars here, mm -hmm. so everybody can pack your swag bag. All right. We have some alternative peanut butter, some mm -hmm. sun butter, um, some fruit-sweetened cranberries. And also, you uh, you got a pamphlet for, for, for more information. That's right. So I have a program on my website right now. It's called The 28-Day Difference. What's the um, website? Uh, it's www.nutritionair.com um, and you can go there and find out all about it starts June 4th really all excited all right and I want to bring in principal Cameron over here guys give it up for principal Cameron 
No, and, and I understand this is all part of a, a much bigger initiative here uh, in York Region, right? Yeah, we have a focus. One of our the things we're focusing on in York Region is on mental health and well-being. And so when Shauna approached me about um, what she does for a living, I thought it was a great way to engage the community. And we've had an amazing time and learned a lot. Right, Mavs? Yeah. You know, you know, hel he hel healthy food, healthy mind, it all, it all comes together. Did, uh, did you have fun today? Yeah. Yeah, I can tell. Your eyes have been like, bye, guy, the whole time. What's your name? Ariana. Ariana. And guys, uh, by the way, Layla, we remember Layla. I don't know if you remember from a week ago when we were at Hatch, back round two. Did you have fun this time? Yeah. Guys, what, what did you, first of all, what did you learn today about healthy eating, about the nutrition revolution? To always eat healthy. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. We all want to be healthy, right? That's yeah. right. All right, guys, you guys were fantastic today. Enjoy your infused water, the parfaits, the pasta salad, and uh, congratulations with the nutrition revolution. Thank you. All right, guys, so you know what's going to happen? We're going to take a quick commercial break, and... You're watching CB 24 Breakfast. We'll be back. Woo! Like butter. It was easy. Awesome. Good job, guys.